Can you direct me to Sandy Powell Bank's dressing room? Well, I guess if you walk six paces to the right, you'll sure go past it, for it's right here on the left. Oh, thanks. Thank you for directing me. Don't thank me. We are all directors here. You'll hear Sandy Powell Bank singing if you open that door. Come in. Are you uh, Sandy? Uh, yes. I'm Sandy, the film star, the greatest of them all. For my handsome features, all the ladies have to fall. They say at making love, I'm the best they've ever seen. I'm Sandy, the film star, the idol of the screen. Uh, now, Mr. Powerbank, yes? I represent a paper called Cinema Sidelights. Mm. It comes out once a month. Now, tell me, Mr. Powerbank, how did you come to be a film star? Well, I didn't come to be a film star. I came to whitewash the ceiling. Oh, you came to whitewash the ceiling? Yeah. I wonder what would have happened if you hadn't come to whitewash the ceiling. Well, the ceiling would have still been dirty, I suppose. <laughs> uh, tell me what happened. Well, I'd been at work about two hours, you see, when one of our leading ladies passed me. Yeah. I was up a ladder at the time, and she said, Oh, look at that man's lovely profile. Then she turned to one of the film directors and said, this man has a big future in front of him. Of course, I know what made her say that. Oh, and what was that? Well, I got my lunch in my waistcoat pocket, you <laughs> see. <laughs> then what did you say? Well, I told him I'd been an actor once. Oh, how long were you an actor? I've just told you, once. Oh, I see. Do you uh, prefer the film? Well, I do, yes, because I get my meals regularly now, do you see? <laughs> yes. Of course, I always did like moving pictures. Only the day before I came here, I moved my mother-in-law's picture from the front room into the wash house. <laughs> <laughs> Weren't you nervous when you were on the floor? Oh, not a bit. Why? Well, I've been on the floor all my life, really, you know. Yes, of course, uh, they gave you a test. Oh, they had to do that, yes. I had to register fear, misery, and ecstasy. How did you register ecstasy? I couldn't help it. <laughs> I had a pint bottle of beer in each hand. <laughs> I quite understand that. Yeah. Uh, was the test okay? Oh, they said the expression of joy was marvellous. And how did you register misery? They told me it was cold tea. <laughs> <laughs> Although a star now, I see you began at the bottom of the ladder. Oh, right at the bottom. Of course, in my third picture, I was right at the top. You were? Mm, I was a window cleaner in that <laughs> one. <laughs> I suppose you get carried away in your love scene. Well, of course, it all depends upon the heroines you happen to be working with. Yes. Yeah. Yes, right. Some of them take a long time to get warmed up, you know. <laughs> of course, some of them get well away at the start and off you go. <laughs> I suppose it's very hot when the lights are on. Uh, it, it gets hotter though when they go out, believe me. <laughs> uh, <laughs> the fun men. Have you ever played the villain or the dirty dog? Well, only when I'm at home. Never in the film. Ah, there's the bell. I must go on the set now. Oh, yes. Yes, I'm doing a picture with one of our most famous leading ladies. Would you like to see me do my stuff? Oh, yeah, I would have, but it's very kind of you. All right, well, come on, we'll just go over to the other side and then we'll... Thank you very much. Oh, that's all right. Stand by all lights there. Bring that second camera closer. Is the sound okay? Okay! Right, oh, everybody in the set for the third sequence. Where's Mr. Powerbank? I'm here, Your Worship. Stand by, please, leading lady. Is that the leading lady over there? Yes, that's her. And you'll be surprised when you know who she is. Hmm. She goes on now. Oh, I want to be alone. I want to be alone. You know, she gets 6,000 pounds a week for saying that. <laughs> yes, listen, listen. No, no, I want to be alone. I want to be alone. I expect she's just being paid, you see, and she wants to count it. <laughs> she might be a tan of short. <laughs> are you ready, Mr. Powerland? Right, you are. Now, this is where I go on. Ah, uh, oh, my lotus, my beautiful lotus. Lotus, be happy. Lotus, I have come back. Uh, I have returned. Uh, no, no. Yes, yes. No, no. Uh, don't argue, don't argue. I've come back, I've told you. I'm here. Ah, uh, I am happy to be with you, my lotus. Uh, lotus, are you happy to be with me? Yes, I want to be alone. I want to be alone. I am so sad. Oh, half a minute. Now, turn it up. Half a minute. Now, fair, fair. Now, there's reason in everything. What's the matter, Mr. Powerbank? Well, how can I act with a woman that keeps saying she wants to be alone? 
Here I'm supposed to have come 12,000 miles from Barnsley to see Locus, and all she says she wants to be alone all the time. I don't know what she wants to do, but her mind isn't on her business at all. I want to be alone. Oh. I want, want to, to be, be alone. alone. Say, well, I guess we'll cut this scene and make a break for lunch. Yes. Oh cut, cut. Break for lunch, everybody. That's what we better do. Is she coming with us? No, no, I think I go home. Oh, she's go home, yes. Give it a Macintosh. I'll bet the only friend she's got in this world is her shadow. I'm not Excuse kidding. me, Mr. Palbank, but uh, are you temperamental? Oh, I'm very temperamental. And the more temperamental you are, the more money you get. You I see. suppose you get uh, carried away sometimes. Oh, we do. Only last week I was playing a very heavy part. Oh, and what were you doing? Shifting girders. <laughs> And were you carried away? Yes, one of them fell on me, you see. What was your biggest picture? My biggest picture? Yes. The birth of a nation. Oh, and what did you do in that? I kept running for the doctor. <laughs> well, I must go back to my dressing room now. Oh, uh, may I come along with you? Oh, no, no. I want to be alone. <laughs> I want to be alone. Well, in that case, I'll wish you good day. Right, you are. So long. And don't forget to put in your paper that you've had the honor of speaking to Sandy, the film star, the best you'll ever see. King Kong and Wallace Beery, they want to act with me. When I start to vamp them, all the ladies fall. For Sandy, the film star, oh, I want to be alone. I think I'll go home now. <laughs> <laughs>